on your side tonight, looking into hazy hemp laws in the Carolinas. Hemp is legal in both North and South Carolina, but there's a gray area on how cannabis can be sold. In North Carolina, hemp includes any part of the cannabis plant. It can be sold without a license in any form as long as the product contains less than 0.3% THC. Last year, North Carolina Governor Roy Cooper signed the law declassifying hemp as a controlled substance with these guidelines. Well, now South Carolina is where things get a little hazy. The Hemp Farming Act requires a license to sell, un, a licensee, I should say, to sell unprocessed hemp. But there's different interpretation of what's considered unprocessed hemp. Having the wrong idea could force business owners to close their shops. The branding behind hemp in South Carolina is tonight's cover story. Is this hemp leaf processed or unprocessed? It depends who you ask. South Carolina state law requires processing hemp before sale. That means turning it into a marketable form. That's it. I'd like someone to explain to me how you can take a living plant growing in soil or otherwise, take it down, dry it, trim it, package it. Like, how is that not a process? Well, in January, Columbia police raided Michael Sims' store for marijuana and unprocessed hemp. An attorney general's office opinion letter states putting hemp leaf in packaging doesn't cut it. But that's not the law. That opinion came at the request of SLED, which had agents at the Crown Town seizure. A records request confirms Columbia police don't have a documented stance on processed versus unprocessed hemp. Complete disappointment, but I'm not surprised uh, one bit. Depending on what part of South Carolina you go to, um, you know, even within a city, not even just other cities, within one city, you see many different levels of enforcement, many different levels of interpretation of the law. A spokesperson says the department follows the law, but declined to elaborate on the department's view of processing. In the meantime, you can tell us your thoughts about hemp laws in both North and South Carolina. You can connect with us on Instagram and Twitter using the hashtag OYS tonight. You can also scan the QR code to get to our mobile menu where you can write us an email.